What's good, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Nonfiction. This is Ready Set Geek, and we have a brand new reaction for the Halo series. Now, from season one, which was a very long time ago, I I watched it and I I actually enjoyed it. So, just a background for me: I was a PlayStation kid. Still a PlayStation. I have a PlayStation right here next to my camera, but I've only played Halo maybe two times at a friend's house uh, when I was much much older. So I didn't play it in. I didn't play it during the time when it was his most famous or his most hottest. So I don't know the full story. I have watched some of the mini movies that they have produced over the years, some of the cartoon animated movies over the years. So I have an understanding of those, but not from a game perspective. You know what I'm saying? When I watched the first season of the series, I rather enjoyed it. I liked where the story was going. I understood what they were trying to do. It wasn't really complex. I enjoyed the weapons. I enjoyed the ships. I enjoyed the tech. I enjoyed the creatures. I enjoyed Master Chief himself and the idea of what was happening with Cortana. I liked that. Like I said, I liked the first season. It wasn't a ama- it wasn't like amazing, but it was entertaining and it was good. It was a fun watch, and I pretty much binged it all. A link down below if you want to watch the trailer by yourself. With that being said, let's get into it. See what they got going. People of rage. I love the way it looks too. Bring you blessings. Yeah, see you. See you do it. Know that I am the instrument of your extinction. Instrument of your extinction. Extinction. Know that I am. Death. Ooh. I love that weapon. The way it, the design of that weapon is so simplistic, but it's bad ass. your faces okay so he's back he's back defeat no! and I do not see surrender I will not make the stand mm. we have something the enemy does not we have heroes <laughs> the battle ends just call it a victory and say it was because of me because of something I did or something you are something you can't see but you feel it I like that shot This looks good, man. It looks good. Ooh. Maybe one duck my head. You know what? At the end of that, it's had a season one recap. Maybe? Spartans are our only effective weapons against the Covenant. They're faster, stronger, smarter. Just keep on killing. I don't think the situation is different. I am. Okay, yeah. Different. Something we need to know about the Spartan program. What they did to us is only permanent if we choose to let it be. Hello, Dr. Halsey. I'm Chris. I forgot about him, yeah. My directive is to integrate fully with the Master Chief. And in time, you will do that. I've seen what Covenant weapons are capable of. Entire planets turned to glass. We've been fighting these alien creatures for years, and we still have no idea what they want. Covenant forces appear to be excavating. Yeah, that's it right there. Only ring we chaka. Sacred ring. Halo. Oh, it's a weapon. Tell me why I should trust you. We are the same. Don't trust her. I remember. I remember. Start to remember now. Start to remember something now. Don't trust her. <laughs> you are talking about humankind's first incursion into covenant-controlled space. We can do yeah. it. Yeah. 
if I remember correctly, Covenant, Covenant was raising her up to betray them. No, no! Take over my body. I told you I may not be able to bring you back. It's the only way. Find the halo. Win the war. There is something within us, in humans, something worth protecting. I forgot how I many. I forgot how many storylines was running in this in the season. I honestly thought after season one it was done. I thought it was done. I because you've seen all the complaints from people and the negative negativity, which I get tired of seeing people negative stuff. Just let series be. Sometimes it, it's not what you, it's not what you want it to be, but it's, it works for somebody. Like it worked for me because I didn't play Halo. I didn't. I watched some of the movies, but I wasn't like a crazy fiend for it. So because of that, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it for what it was. It was a good story. It told a good story. It told multiple levels of stories in one season, and it was conv- it was convoluted. But at the same time, if you just paid attention, you kind of had an idea what was going on. But like I said, there was multiple storylines, and because of that, you kind of got to a point where you weren't sure one hundred percent who all. Uh, my chief could trust, especially when it came to the, to the young girl trying to bring her back. And you knew that some people were definitely lying about what their purpose was or who they were trying to help or protect. And, you know, some people were just in it for themselves, you know. But I actually, I, I honestly enjoyed season one. I enjoyed it. I liked it. It was it was different from things I've seen. The action was really nice for a TV show. The I love the Halo weapons. That's one thing I wish I wish when I was younger, if I did play it, I, w- I wish I did because I really enjoy the different things that it brings to the table not just the music people talk about like the music is badass like the, the soundtrack from the games and, and the master chief's theme badass 100 percent. i wish they would have been able to get together and put together a halo movie i'm glad at least we got a tv series they've been trying for years to do a halo movie and they couldn't if you ever seen the first avatar the ships in the first avatar or were actually created for the halo movie but they end up selling that, that product over to them to use for their movie because that the script kept falling apart so yeah man I, i'm looking forward to this i'm ha- i'm gonna have to go back and binge watch the entire first season just to get everything crystal clear so i can remember season two is dropping i think say february 8th halo series returns february 8th exclusively on paramount plus stream two episodes at pre- oh at premiere and new episodes every thursday through march 21st okay so farch farch <laughs> Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this. Appreciate you. Love you. Hope you have a wonderful day, night, evening, morning, noon, wherever you are in the world today. Thank you for being a part of the family and thank you for checking out videos. I know I've been going for quite a while, but thank you for checking them out. If you got to this part, leave a green heart down below. Appreciate you. Love you. On to the next. We got more, baby. We got more.